What's up, Blake? Sick Kraken back with another video. I tried to see if I can change up my intro a little bit there, but I, I, my brain was just like, no, not Sid, not today. Whatever you're thinking, it's not happening today. I'm back once again with another video. For today's video, it is Crimes and Punishments Sherlock Holmes. Now, this was a free game on Xbox for Games for Gold, and it's been a while since I've actually played a game that's like this, most likely with puzzles and crime and stuff, and I, ah, let's, I just want to play the game. Let's just go do this. Let's do this. Part 4, Chapter 1. And there goes the book. The heck? Uh... I'm assuming... Oh my god. Oh my god. What the heck? Oh god, wait, I have to move now? What is this? Take cover. Go, 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 go. Oh my god. Go, go, go. Under the table. Can I get under the... Go, 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 go. Ah! Hey, there's a bear's head. Hi, bear's head. Okay, what is he doing? Yo, Sherlock. Can you just chill out for a second? God, he's like going crazy over here all of a sudden, just aimlessly shooting. <laughs> Stop, Holmes! Is that you, Watson? Yes, of course it is. <laughs> and you almost killed me. Nonsense. I was aiming for the vases. What? Blindfolded. Watson, quiet, please. I'm trying to concentrate. Blinking handcuffs. Policeman. Ninth step avoided. Inspector Lestrade. Ah, Lestrade. What is it this time? He can see me. What the heck? Well, here it is, and it's a good one. <laughs> oh, he was using his sense Gentlemen of hearing to Kent. notice what was going around him. Okay, yeah, that's, that's actually pretty good. A sailor, most probably. What happened here? Not bad, Sherlock. Not bad. Not bad. Not oh, bad Mr. at all. Holmes, how could you? It's the only exercise I've had all week. <laughs> a grateful client from Limoges sent me a vase collection this morning. I couldn't think of a better use for it. Wow, that's really nice. Just go and aimlessly shoot around at vases that somebody grifted you. Really nice, Sherlock. Really nice. You were blindfolded. That was very good. Can I have a try? Am I the only sane one here? I suppose that Watson is right, Inspector. Oh man. A little brain work would be preferable now. Do please tell us more about Black Peter. Peter Carey, born in 1845 and 50 years old. An ambitious sort, he achieved much success in seal and whale hunting around Ooh. Scandinavia. Ooh. Retired in 1884 with a small fortune. Well, yeah, at least he, he had a small fortune. Money in a property better than nothing. Woodman's Lee. Give me All right. half an hour to prepare, Inspector. Take your okay, time that, this is a little bit interesting. I, I, I kind of understand yard, how Sherlock Holmes does stuff. this thing, you know? He always makes sure that he has stuff? his, like, sense they of everything, perception. Reserve. Kind of like challenges himself in some ways, which is pretty interesting. I'd, I'd do I that if I was an investigator as well, but I don't know. It's, it's Sherlock Holmes. Like, come on. on. It's Sherlock. Oh, it's Sherlock Holmes. Ooh, this is cool. Now we have a third person perspective. I thought the whole game would have been like, you know, just like point and click type of thing, but it's not. It's not. Apparently, it's not. It's not. Okay. And I think the neighbor's dog is screaming upstairs. Why, dog? It's okay. It's going to be fine. This is Fate of Peter, uh, Black Peter. <laughs> <laughs> Black Peter. <laughs> Inspector Lestrade pays a visit to Baker Street, where he's where he relates to Holmes the grotesque affair that involved the former captain known as Black Peter. Where's the wardrobe? I think that's it. Is that it? That's not the wardrobe. What the heck? That Watson's room. This is Watson's room. Why? Where's my room? Watson. No, I don't. Oh my god. You have to find some, at least some way to out. To try to get this. What the heck? <laughs> Alright, uh, don't worry. I'm coming over there. Alright, yeah, cool. Alright, so can I, like, run? Alright, this is just. Whoa, what is this? Concentrate your attention on finding details that, o that others are inclined to overlook. Okay. So. It's kind of like basically improving your senses a little bit more. Land around stone pathway. Hmm. Footprints. Okay, okay. Ooh, let's examine the footprints. Can we do that? Ooh, Ooh let's have a closer look. These footprints appear to be quite large. Hmm. Interesting, interesting. All right, what are some other things? So we have the footprints that are there. Kind of weird. We already got the evidence required for that. 
What else is around here? I feel like there probably is something. Like, hello? Hello? Uh, excuse me, sir. Can I can I go in this cabin? Because I'm, a uh, Sherlock Holmes, you know? Oh, freak. Wait, hold on. Let me just talk to him. Let's see if I can. Mr. Holmes? Can I go through? Can I? I can't go through because... Oh, wait a minute. Hold on. There... I thought there was a lock on here. What the heck? There's no lock on here. Game, what are you doing? Stop messing with my emotions. My condolences, Mrs. Carey. Mm. Thank you, Mr. Holmes. I'm very sorry. Uh, let's see. What do we have here? Is there a gardener? When was the body found? And anything unusual that night? Hmm. What is this? Alright, so... Wait, what? What the heck? Oh, okay. Oh, wait a minute. I can look at the characteristics of an actual person? What? Okay, so... Wait, hold on. Let's go forward. What is this? Cameo. Let's see. Go down. Go down. Oh, it's going downwards. Ooh, what is this? Uh, Catholic Rosary, so she's very religious, most likely Catholic, as of what it was shown. Uh, what is this? Uh, Crest... Crest Tit. <laughs> crest Tit. That's the only time I'm even allowed to say that. Alright, so we already got her portrait done. Um, let's see... When was the body found by any chance? Do you remember Mrs. at Casey. what time you found your husband's body? Mrs. Casey. <laughs> In the morning, at around 7 o'clock. Okay. I noticed the cabin door was open, but mm -hmm. I didn't go in to take a look, for I knew my husband would not have liked it. Okay. At around ten o'clock, I dared to glance in through the door and oh dear. It's a little bit too much time. A little bit too much time. That's kind of creepy, man. Look, you, you could have done something else. You could have went in and checked it. It was open. Oh, okay. ah. Okay. Did he have any visitors by any chance? Was your husband accustomed to receiving visitors? Oh, no, I don't think so. I mean, he didn't really have many friends. Mm -hmm. We lived quite an isolated life here, after oh. his retirement. Oh, that's very sad here. That kind of sounds like me a little bit. I mean, I, I do I do have friends, okay? I do have friends. I know some people are going to like say, you, you definitely do not have any friends. Well, I do. Anything unusual that night? Because I feel like that could be a little bit of importance. Like, come on. Madam, can you tell me if you saw or heard anything unusual like, upon the night of the murder? Anything at all? Don't like, let me know, please. I heard a terrible scream. Okay. But I thought nothing of it then. He would scream okay. all the time when he was drunk. You didn't manage... Okay, he would scream all the time when he was drunk, so she kind of got accustomed to the fact that whenever he got drunk, he would just scream. I get that. Still. Uh, what else? No, I don't want to say that yet. Everything will become easier. Can Let's just do that one. tell me what occurred on the evening of the murder? Well, Peter got drunk in the evening. He okay. was in such a terrible temper. Mm. Usually, whenever that happened, he'd stay all night drinking in his cabin before passing out. You see, that's not good. Evil temper, I mean, not evil tempers. Really bad temper tantrums with a mixture of alcohol does not go well in some people. Others may have a kind of positive effect where it's more happiness others not oh there's even first person view oh <gasps> this game has just gotten an a plus by me that is really awesome i thought it was only third person but then i noticed that you can get a closer look with b which is first wow wow i did not know that okay let's just talk to this guy this uh inspector Carey's body is inside the cabin we took care not to touch anything thank you i appreciate that let's do this now Alright, here's the big magic. The magic I can't wait for. The door is locked. And it's locked. Wait just Why? a moment, Mr. Holmes, and I'll open it. I locked it yesterday to ensure that no one should enter the cabin and tamper with the evidence. Oh, that would be kind of oh, creepy if there was. Thinking. Hello, hello, hello. <laughs> hello, hello, it hello. It seems to me that someone has tried to force it, Mr. Holmes. Let me hmm. see. Uh, so we can move... All around here. It seems like the keyhole. Something's wrong with the keyhole. The keyhole. Door lock. Scratches. These Why scratches is it scratches? Fresh. Nice. Very nice. Spears. Whoa. What a terrible way to die. Hmm. I like how Holmes is just so calm, like, when seeing something like that. Okay, can you guys close this door? Like, I need some privacy? No? Guys, really? Really? Alright, yeah, whatever. I, I just leave the door open. <laughs> That's so nice. Like, just leave it open. Alright, let's get to work. 
Alright. Let's see, what is there? Okay, there's spears that are here. There was three. Um, well, one's obviously missing because it's in now our guy over here. <laughs> uh, unfortunately, which sucks. Let's see. Hmm. Shelf. What is shelf? Shelf. shelf, shelf. Let's see, what is this? Uh, sperm whale tooth. <laughs> sperm whale tooth. Is there anything else around here? Or is it just this? Because they're... The tooth of a hmm. sperm whale. Probably from one of Peter Carey's catches. Okay, yeah, yeah alright, there's nothing really there that's kind of close to this, let's see. Uh, the ship's logs, cool, cool, cool. Anything else here? Oh, let's see his boots. Boots! Peter Those are boots. mine. They look to be a size 8. Oh, wait a minute, interesting, okay. Uh, alright, if his boots are a size 8, I have a feeling that these- Let's go back to the footprints. Footprints. Can we use the boots? Because I'm pretty sure you can- Yes, you can! Uh, I could drag it down. These Let's see. Don't match the footprints. Hmm. I oh wait, I actually notice with when it comes to the footprints as well. There's like little holes in it. Ah, oh, okay. Evidence is required. Come on. All right. Let's see. What else do we have here? Let's see. Pool of blood. Examine. No. It's not cool. Not that either. Uh. See. What is this ship nameplate? Sea, sea unicorn. <laughs> She yes. the ship that Let's see, what is this? Alright, rotate the object in any direction to examine it thoroughly and recover any new details and uncover it. The initials too. PC have been crudely Cru burned. A sailor's work. Okay, so know that you know it's him. Okay. Rotate it to the back. Uh, let's open the flap. Open it! Anything? What is this? Oh, it's just tobacco. Hmm. hmm. This aroma is familiar, well, what the heck? but to recognize it, I must construct my associations in, in one, in one... Oh, oh, okay. Rotate... Wait, what? What the heck is this? This is so weird. Okay, so this is like a weird type of puzzle you gotta like put together. Okay. I gotta... Oh, wait a minute. I think I have an understanding of what I gotta do now. I gotta make sure to line them up. So what would this be? This is up and down, right? Three hours later. Oh, okay, that's... I had it the wrong way the whole time. Okay, matter of fact, I feel like this is a good stopping point. Of course, this is something completely different. Um, I wanted to test this out and see if you guys enjoy this type of thing. I know it's a new game, and of course, I love doing new things with the channel. But as usual, feel free to give the video a thumbs up and leave a comment. Tell me if you want more of this, if you want me to continue this, because this is a really interesting game and I want to see how you guys feel about this because I do all this stuff for you guys as well. Hopefully everyone has an awesome day. Stay cool, Plague. This is Sir Kraken. Peace out.